Hello viewers! Welcome to Mine Cows! Today, I am going to be recording Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze, which is the brand new Donkey Kong game that came out today. That's right, today I got it today. Hopefully I can edit it and post it today. Um, so yeah, this is uh, my Wii U, as you can see here. It's very lovely. And if you've never heard of the Wii U, that's because Nintendo sucks at marketing. But, um, as you can see, here it is, Donkey Kong Country, Tropical Freeze. I'm very excited to play this. I hope you're excited to watch. Um, I've never recorded a console game before. We've never recorded console games for our channel. I just recently got an Elgato Game Capture HD, and it seems to be working very well so far. And, um, with all the tests I've done with it, uh, I highly recommend it and it is very small and very portable so we're thinking of maybe you know passing it around between us um maybe some uh, other people in the mine cows can record some ps3 games or xbox uh, xbox games sorry um so yes here we go donkey kong country tropical freeze um and i have uh just to make sure the sound works through the gamepad i have just tried out and uh, tried it out a little bit um and this is something i really like about it it they yeah they say you can hear the singing of these ladies saying donkey kong and it's very beautiful and it makes a great first impression oh my god i'm pretty excited to play this game uh i at first when uh it was announced in the nintendo direct i don't know like a year ago or something um, I was like, oh, come on, this is Retro Studios' new game. Uh, in case you guys don't know, they're the ones who made, uh, Metroid Prime, which I'm a huge fan of. I love all the Metroid games. Um, I even like Other M a little bit. I mean, it's stupid, but it's, it's fun. I mean, you know. But, um, they, yeah, this was their next big project, and I was a little skeptical at first, because I was like, oh, man, I really want a new Metroid game, but... This looks to be really good, especially with some of the more recent trailers. And it's beautiful from what I've seen. So, let's uh, press the A button to start right here. And I have not made a new game yet. So, here we go. This is my first impressions. I have not played this game yet at all. I guess I'm player one. That's pretty fun. Oh, okay. That's weird that you can't just... Whatever, okay. I guess I'll use the left stick. Yes, play single player. Options, you can switch between left stick and blah 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 blah. Okay, that's a bit weird that you can't just do it by yourself. Whatever, whatever. I'm sure this game will be great. Uh, I'm guessing there's gonna be a cutscene right here, so I'm gonna shut up for a while.
Oh my god. That was... That was a beautiful cutscene right there. And the music, guys! Oh my god! Yeah, I heard David Wise is back. He did the soundtrack for the original Donkey Kong. Um, um, okay, X. X, 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 X. Or Y. Either one. Right. Aw, oh, yeah! Look at this game, guys! Secret? Oh, sweet! I found a secret already! I'm gonna... I can tell this is gonna be great. I'm probably gonna find all the things. And... Okay, just something I'm gonna let you know. Um, I'm probably gonna suck. This game is known for being extremely, um, relentlessly and... Oh my god! I can swim! That was not in country! Oh, man. Okay. Anyway, uh, so yeah, David Wise, back for the soundtrack. He did the original Donkey Kong in Country and the other ones when, uh, Rare was in charge. Um, I actually did not play those games. Well, I've played a little bit of Donkey Kong Country, but not enough to get a good feel for it. I mean, uh, I've played... Yeah, okay, Donkey Kong Country. I have not played much of... Donkey Kong Country, but I have played a lot of Donkey Kong Country Returns, um, which I have played on the Wii and on the 3DS. Um, okay, there's a heart. This game is so beautiful! Look at this! Okay, what do I do here? Okay, right. Okay. <laughs> what is that? Okay. So I can roll with Y, and I have to stomp on the enemies like I'm playing freaking Mario. Except this is not Mario, because this is the toughest game you will ever play in the world. More than Dark Souls. Come on, go back down. Here. Ah, I see. Oh my god! First death, everyone! Great. As you can tell, I'm great at this game! <laughs> All right, I don't. Th I believe there are puzzle pieces. There were in country. I don't know if it's the same formula with this. It probably is. I imagine it is. But um, I love swimming. Okay, so I have not um normally. I do not normally record games the day they come out, and that was something I did with I believe Bioshock Infinite, Burial at Sea DLC. Which, um, I have not actually uploaded the rest of that. If you guys want to see that, let me know. I'll probably just end up doing it anyway, though. Um, because I kind of feel like I need to finish that. I have already recorded all of them. I haven't gotten the time to edit them, because there's so much I need to edit still. And I have not been on top of my stuff lately. Okay, cool, cool. Just wait for this. Come on. Let's go. Puzzle piece? Alright, cool. First puzzle piece. I believe there- yeah, there are nine, duh, as I just said. But I remember that there were nine in country. Okay, what do I do? Pull it? Okay. Okay. Pull it. Great. What is that? Interesting. Interesting. Banana! Flying banana? What the heck is that? What? <laughs> that was a flying banana, guys. <laughs> And I love the music. I can't say that enough. It's so... Oh my god. First impressions, this game is great. So I'm... I'm gonna try and do this entire game. Hopefully. It might get too difficult for me. Now I have Diddy Kong here. Okay. Oh. Okay. He can do a jetpack thing. See? Jetpack thing. Very helpful. But I hear there's a lot of other Kongs in this game. There's Cranky Kong. Who, like can um he doesn't get hurt by spikes and stuff he uh if because he uses his cane to bounce around because you know logic um okay i can bounce on turtles who have uh okay goggles because that's normal right <laughs> okay oh right and use that to spring okay 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 very interesting I've been playing a lot of Rayman Legends lately. That game is great. 
If you guys have not played Rayman Legends, I don't care what you get it for, Wii U is the best version, because it was made for Wii U, and then they betrayed Nintendo and put it on the other things. But, I guess that's a good thing. Get it for any system. It's such a great game. But th today we are here to talk about Donkey Kong. And, my god, I cannot get that O oh, for the life of me. Come on. Come on, you have Diddy Kong with you. You can do this. You have a jetpack. Good job. Great job, man. Great job. Come on. I'm not used to swimming. Right, what do I do? Oh, yeah. Ground pound. Go. One thing that was in the Wii version... Oh, how did I do that? Okay. So I guess I can throw these around like the Koopa shells? Or not. The enemies are different in this game. In Country, they were... In Returns, they were a bunch of... Like... Okay. That wasn't even worth it. Just bananas? Come on. In Country Returns, they were these... Tiki things. Whoa. And to be honest, they were kind of boring looking. Oh! I missed the puzzle piece! God dang it! Oh yeah, it's something new. Uh, 3D camera angles in this game. I don't know what's gonna add to the gameplay, but uh, it, I, apparently it does add to it. A uh, bit skeptical, but we'll see. Got the N. There's four letters that you need to collect. K-O-N-G. To spell out Kong for those who are illiterate. Um, okay. So there you go, 3D camera angles, very lovely. But in this game, they're like Vikings with like, there's like penguins and walruses and I believe they're called the Snowmads, as ridiculous <laughs> as that sounds. All right, let's go get the thing, banana. Oh yeah, with Diddy Kong, you can like roll infinitely and it's great. Come on, roll, roll. Good job. That one had a helmet. And so, I don't know, I like penguins, they're pretty cool. Ever played Blood Penguin? It's the best um, MMO there is ever. And uh, if you don't agree with me, you're an idiot. Cause of course, it's the best thing ever. I just want to break all these crates because uh, ever since Half Life, I need to break every single crate I see. Come on. You can do it. Can you roll in? Nope, can't roll into the crates. Have you guys ever played 999? I know that's kind of a random thing to suddenly switch topics to, but. Okay, it's this not very well name, known game for the Nintendo DS, which I've been playing the crap out of lately, because oh my god, it is so good, and I can't believe I've never heard of it before. It's like this, okay, it's this puzzle, this story-based puzzle game, a huge emphasis on story, like really, like, I'm not even sure if it's a video game, it's more of like an interactive novel kind of thing, but there are puzzles, so I guess that's the video game portion of it. What? Come on, that wasn't even fair. But it's uh, it's called nine. What is it? Nine uh, nine hours, nine persons, nine doors. I think. Can I go back there? How do I go back there? There's like some sort of target here that I have to hit. Can I do that? Come on. No. Okay. Uh, I'm sure maybe it. I need. Did I seriously just do that? Okay. I probably need to unlock a certain character in order to get to there. Okay, anyway, 999. It's uh, basically like Saw, but with a lot more thought put into the story and the characters. Like, oh my god, it's gotta be one of the best stories I've ever seen in a video game. Like, forget The Last of Us, forget... What are some other great story-based games? Uh, Bioshock Infinite, I really liked. Uh, as I have said before, probably. But, my god, 999! I know that sounds stupid to say, oh, forget The Last of Us, but seriously? Whoa, what did I just do? Um, I did a thing, and they high-fived. Okay. That's a thing. <laughs> I, I don't know what that was. I'll see you later, maybe. <laughs> Some sort of, like, powerful attack, maybe? Oh, there's, like, I don't know. It looks like there's, like, some sort of meter uh, on the top left, like, next to them. So maybe that builds up and I use it. Okay, got some bananas. 999. It's like Saw, but better. Um, there are these nine people trapped on a ship. Um, 
they were kidnapped and put there by some dude called Zero. He has a gas mask. He looks pretty cool. Um, and so they have to find the exit. They're playing this game, apparently, called the Nonary Game. He's all like, I want us to play a game. And, um, yeah, it's like Saw, so, but way better. And, oh my god. Um, and so you get to learn about all these nine characters. Um, ah, it's hard to explain. So there are these, there's nine doors. You have to find a door with the number nine on it in order to escape um and so everyone can um there's oh god how do i explain this each door has a number on it there's nine doors total or so you think um and you have to get like okay each character has a number like a watch with a number on their wrist and what's this Inventory. Okay. Yeah. And only a certain amount of people can go through each door, and there's a lot of betrayal and a lot of stuff. You gotta make decisions. There's so many endings. Well, I think there's only six, but there's. It seems like a lot, because the game is made to be played over and over and over again, because the first playthrough. You will be really unsatisfied because you won't find out anything, but there's just so much mystery involved. I'm not doing this game any justice because I suck at describing games that are as complex as 999. Some of the puzzles are really good. It's like escape the room type puzzles, like if you've ever played those flash games where you have to like escape the room and find all the- find just certain objects so that you can do certain things so that you can escape the room, so that you get the thing, and you can do the stuff. Yeah. Turtle. Oh right, I throw it. I thought I had to like jump on it to kill it. Cool. No! Oh right, I can swim! <laughs> Forgot the water doesn't kill you in this game. It didn't, uh, returns. Okay, okay. I, I want to hear the ooh sound, you know, like in Rayman, when you find a secret area and you uncover it, you hear ooh, like the aliens in Toy Story. Yeah, great game. Anyway, 999, get that game right now. It's one of the best games on DS, not even kidding. I'm not doing this game any justice, and those who have played it will know that I suck at this. This and this, this being the game and this being describing 999. So I need to get up there. Oh, wait! Oh! I don't have a jetpack! This is, um... I don't know her name. Crap. She's uh, his sister, I think. Right? Right? God, I need to be more knowledgeable about this stuff before I go and do Let's Plays. Um, I need the K. Okay? So, how do I get there? Okay, so she gives me, like, sort of a boost a little bit. Like, a jumping boost. That was probably a stupid decision. I probably should have done that. Okay. Alright, alright. Then the K right there. Come on. Yay, I did it. Wow, yay. So cool. Okay. Okay, so there's a secret area. His fur looks, like, really realistic in this game for some reason. I mean, it's not a bad thing at all. I mean, like, it's pretty cool. <laughs> Okay, I have to get all the bananas, I believe, to get a puzzle piece. Oh, great, and there's a time limit. I did not see that. These kind of things were in returns, and I hated them. Come on. Come on! Come on! Get the bananas, you fool! Get them! Get! Yes! Yes! I did it, guys. Oh, man, that's probably the only one I'm ever gonna get throughout this whole Let's Play. Anyway, um, so I haven't been editing lately, as you can probably tell by the lack of videos on our channel for, I think, two weeks. Um, I have not had a lot of time to edit, um, and also I'm lazy, so I am very sorry about that. I'm going to be editing- Oh, come on, I can't jump on the sh I can't jump on the shark and kill him? And now I lost, um, my sister? Is- if she is my sister? She's a Kong, so I don't know. Well, whatever. Anyway, I'm gonna get on an editing schedule, and I really want to commit to this, because I really want to get out videos uh, at least like two a week, if not more, because that would be great. 
And I know you guys probably would like to see videos from us. And then if you don't, then I understand. Because our videos can be pretty... What? I wasn't saying anything. Shut up. Our videos are great. We just have to be more consistent with our uploading, definitely. What is this? Is this like a... A bag of snow? I mean... What's in it exactly? Bananas, probably. They're stealing all the bananas, right? It's always what it is, right? Oh, I bet I can... Ah, oh, yeah! Oh, it's a puzzle piece. Okay. Oh, bananas! Don't go up! And I can't get to it. Unless... Come on, jump up there. I need to get to the... Oh my god. Anyway, there's a sequel to 999. The DS game. Um, for 3DS, called Virtue's Last Reward. Uh, it's also on the Vita, I believe, but I don't have a Vita, because it has no games. Nah, I'm sorry, I'm not going to be one of those people. I don't have a Vita because I'm a Nintendo dude, and I play Nintendo things. Come on. Okay, it's hopeless. There's nothing I can do. I really need... What's your name? Is it... Is it Dixie Kong? No, that doesn't sound right. Is it? Maybe? Ah, I don't know. I might just be making that up. Um... I don't even know what to call her. Well, you know what? I'll look it up. Mm. Okay, can I... Okay, there's something there. Coin. Yay. <laughs> I like the enemies in this game. They're a lot less boring, I think, than the, the totem pole creatures. Oh, man. Look at this. So do I lose water? Yeah, there's a water... Er, I'm sorry, air meter there. Thank you, pig, for telling me how to hit things. I appreciate that. Okay, sweet. Well, it says DX. So, I don't know. There's an X in Dixie. So, maybe... I hope I'm right. Otherwise, I look like an idiot. More of an idiot than I always look like. I'm sure something will happen if I collect all these bananas. Otherwise, this is a complete waste of time. Yeah! Coins. I guess coins are nice. You can buy items, right? Fish, can't hit you for some reason. Like I just did. <laughs> I'm sorry, I suck. Alright. There's the puzzle piece. I'd like to collect all nine for once. I've probably missed so many at this point, though. What's in here? Oh no! Dixie Kong, no! Oh no! Why? I've killed my sister. Speaking of that, actually, never mind. Well, I want you have to say it. Now. Oh, come on! I died. Get used to seeing this screen, guys. Um, because this is co-op. Sometimes, thinking of uh, inviting certain people to play this with me and record it, maybe, eventually, one day. What's the deal with these, all these insects everywhere? What's, as, as far as I know, there's only all the snowmads, penguins and walruses, or is it walri? It can't be walri, that's stupid. It might be. Hold A. Oh. Oh, okay, so Dixie Kong can do a hair thing. No, come on. Keep holding it. Do it that do that hair thing. Come on. Come on. Come on, there's gotta be something here. Oh man. Here we go. Here we go. What is that? Whoa, what is that? Okay, come on, hair thing. What? What is that? Whoa. I don't remember that. Okay. What is this? Secret exit. Super Mario World style. I like that blurry background. It's so low def looking. Or maybe it's just my monitor. I'm playing this game on my computer monitor, so um, it looks kind of weird. Uh, as opposed to playing it on the big screen where everything's beautiful. I'm sure on YouTube it'll look fine though. Lost Mangroves. Okay. Great. Well, I guess I found the found the easy exit. Funkies flying by. Shipwreck shore, zipline shrine. What do you guys think? Which one? 